All right, man. Who we got on Futures TV, man? Who the streets rocking with? Got M Dub, motherfucking Bank Road, nigga. Yeah. Shit. That's what's up, man. You been going crazy lately, bro. Like I posted your uh, video when you was at the high school, mm -hmm. turning up. Um, and I posted your other video. I think it was the hood joint. Hood I love. Hood I love. Uh, you know, on Facebook, that shit had over 500 shares. Mm -hmm. So, you know what I'm saying? I had to come out here and chop it up with you, bro. Because you really making noise out here in the Carolinas. Even the videos, it's a whole bunch of views. Yeah. You consistently been working. So, you know what I'm saying? For the people that don't know, let people know who Doug Bank Row is, bro. Doug Bank Row. Just real nigga. You know what I mean? One of a kind from Rockham, North Carolina. Italy, North Carolina. Hamlet, North Carolina. Richmond County, now I don't know. Yeah. North Carolina type shit. Word. Man. So what's, I mean, like, what was it like for you when you was coming up out here in Rockingham? Shit. I'm going to take you back like this. I came up, I was, I moved to Ill I moved from Ilby, North Carolina, when I was down 11 years old. Like, so my childhood was really in Rockham and Ilby. Okay. But, you know, my whole family, I got my mom's side of the family is in Ilby. My pop side of the family is Rockingham, which is Little Philly. You know, from 2016. You know what I'm saying? So, goddamn. But coming up, man, I. F shit. I done got kicked out of every goddamn school that I've ever been in. Shit, I got kicked out of the school that I was just performing in. By uh, Richmond. Richmond, hell yeah. Damn. I got kicked out of there. My 12th grade year. I goddamn, you feel me? I got kicked out of Ellie Virginia High. Kicked out of goddamn League Street. Kid out of Rockingham, everything, you feel me? So, goddamn, coming up with me. My heart and fault, goddamn. Every goddamn body coming up. Yeah. You know what I mean? I did it like, but I done did everything, dog. What you got kicked out for? Shit. The fight? Just. All oh, kind of goddamn shit. Goddamn. Gang activity and just starting up little gangs and. Oh, man, just all type of shit, man. Yeah. So did, yeah. when you went back to uh, perform at Richmond High School, did you see like some of the people that you was in school with, like the teachers and stuff? Or yeah, of course. They, yeah. How they how they take it, seeing that you you know what I'm saying elevating this music shit and not. I mean, shit. They always knew I was gonna be something. They just didn't know what the hell I was gonna be. You yeah. know what I mean? Especially after I down, I had a scholarship at Michigan State for goddamn playing football. Oh, okay. But shit, I got kicked out. Like damn, start taking my music more serious. Yeah, and that's what really got me just, just going crazy. But they respect it though. They love that. I love them too. Yeah. Now you just um, I seen you, you didn't you just come home like a year ago or something like that or for what jail? Yeah. Nah. Oh, you ain't you ain't never get locked up. Nah, okay. I done been locked up. But okay. You probably got never seen a picture of when I did come home for some shit. I done did. Yeah. You feel me? But. That's, that's some shit, I, do you feel me? It's some shit, so, you know, I beat my case. Mm -hmm. I'm good, bro. You can't really talk about it? Nah. Okay. okay. Now, you know, when I first uh, when I first met you, you know what I'm saying, face to face, it was at my event in Raleigh, and you know, shit didn't go as planned, but you mm -hmm. still rocked that bitch out, you know what I'm saying? Like, that shit made me look at you more, like, yo, I respect this shit. Yeah. Um, like, what, what what you think your motivation come from in this music shit, like, really blow? Shit, my mama. My mama was, before I even was doing music, I used to go to the studio with my mama every fucking day. Yeah. I'm <coughs> every motherfucking day. And she seen me, feel me? And uh, I was just like, damn, man, I want to get down. I want to get behind that microphone. Yeah. And just, she was just, she was just got there. Yes, I used to start rapping and shit. She like, you hot. I can say any goddamn thing, some bullshit. Yeah. She like, you hot, well, you hot. That shit made me just keep going. After that, though. I fuck with her, too. She be uh, DMing your music, too. Yeah, she, you yeah, know what I'm yeah. saying? She cool. She go hard, man. Yeah. Go hard for her baby now. Yeah. Shit. That, that, now, you just dropped that Zach Goin uh, tape. Yeah. Um, you, go, you got about, like, nine tracks up there. Yeah. Nine to ten. ten. Yeah, so, I mean, and uh, I see on the art cover, you had uh, you like six of y'all carrying a casket out. Um, what was the meaning behind that? Uh, the Zach Going title. Shit, uh, Zach Going title. 
See, my granddad, the tape was originally called Zach. I had started working on it after my granddaddy passed away. Yeah. And his Vietnam name was Zach, that's what they called him. So I, I um, I was like, I'm gonna name my next tape Zach, because the type of music that I want to put on this tape, and it is on that tape. Yeah. I was like, I'm calling it Zach. I started calling it Zach. Then I lost my little brother, O.D., July 4th. You know what I'm saying? His name, his last name going. My tears going. A lot of people, bro, you feel me? Lost him on July 4th. You feel me? We don't need to celebrate that shit. No more, none of that. Fuck all that, so. Oh, yeah. Goddamn. I just took that tape and just like, Zach going. You feel me? My, my, my grandfather, Vietnam name, and my little bro, last name. Oh, okay. And that tape. I'm, that's what I'm giving you, Zach Goins. I feel like that's who I am. I'm Zach Goins. That's my name, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, because them two, they, they, you know, if you you ever really lost somebody that you really love, then you'll understand exactly what I just, they'll understand exactly what I just said. Yeah. Like, you know, What's your favorite track up there? All of them. Yeah. Every single one of them. Right, so yeah. I mean, what you uh, what you got coming up next, stuff, bro? Like, shit, man, I'm working on this tape called Her Child right now. YPC, yeah. signed with Melvin Ingram. Play with San Diego Chargers, my big bro and shit. Got a little deal with them, whatever. We finna back down, you know, do this media running. You know what I mean? He did got them other stations, you know, and then we gonna promote that tape before it come out or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, shit finna got them get crazy. Got a lot of shit going on, man. There's so much shit going on with it. Yeah. You, know, you know what I mean? Mine can't process it all at one time, so I write it down. Yeah. What, yeah. what you be like, what's your process like when you be going in, like when you be making these songs and stuff, bro? That that dirty sticks, bro. I, I swear, I was listening to that joint on YouTube um, when I was working out today. That shit gave me a boost, like your voice oh, yeah, and everything. How you, <coughs> I'm not saying, don't cross me, nigga. You know what I'm saying? <coughs> Lit, I, so, what you mean, you? like when I go in the studio and record? Yeah, when you when writing it. Uh, when you recording, like <coughs> what's your process be like? <coughs> shit, I go in that motherfucker, get behind that microphone, just talk that shit, and come out. Yeah. I don't one take. Feel me? I, I don't have to goddamn go in that motherfucker and write. I don't have to write no music. You don't go to the studio to write any goddamn way. You go to record. Yeah. When you get there, your shit need to be together before you goddamn even go. You feel me? So I be already shit. On my way to the studio, what I be already knowing, like, I'm about to go ahead and do this song, that song, this song, that song in 30 minutes. You yeah. feel me? You doing that type of shit. I say, you got to say it right now. How I came in. So y'all y'all did y'all was in the studio at the same time we all made that? Yeah, hell yeah, that my dog. That's how I got them came in the goddamn studio. Yeah. And just got them just and he was just like, oh shit. Oh, I'm finna got them and he same got them thing, you feel me? Yeah. That's how that's what about why they that, track like that. What about that that way though, bro? Is you oh, you saying that's like your your favorite track that's really like getting you exposure? I mean, shit, when I first dropped that shit, I ain't even like that shit. Yeah. I really didn't like that shit. I ain't like it, you feel me? But I love all my music, but I just didn't like how they sounded. I ain't think it was recorded right or none of that. Yeah. You feel me? It ain't been mixed or none of that shit. You feel me? I just recorded it. One tape and came out of the booth, you feel what I'm saying? And goddamn, I performed that shit one time, bro. Yeah, the crowd knew it word for word. I'm like, damn, this shit really a movement out here. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. How did that shit make you feel to see all that? Like, was you expecting the crowd to know your shit word for word? Yeah. Yeah. This is my shit. Yeah. All this shit. Straight up. I've been, man, I've been doing this shit since I was got eight years old. My whole county know. Like, they really know what's up with me, you feel me? They know it's you know real. They know it's real. real. They know me. They know every goddamn word come out of my mouth real. That's why I got the support I got from my county. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? From all the damn races. All the races, you feel me? So, shit. Shit big right now. 
Now, with you, you know, everybody fucking with you, you know what I'm saying, in your state, I mean, in your city, mm-hmm. I feel like people in Raleigh, too, fucking with you, mm-hmm. um, all over in, in the Carolinas, but do you think it's harder to really, like, uh, get recognition being from Rockingham, though? No? Oh, yeah, we always gonna have a goddamn tough, that's for anybody that's, they know, you know I mean, how I feel to be a, it's like, we are down... I don't know, man. You probably would have never heard of Rockingham. Bruh, I, I heard of Rockingham like three years ago because I, I used to play basketball and shit. Yeah. But that was about it. I didn't really hear about nobody doing music. Yeah, you feel what I'm you. saying? You know so what I'm saying? When you hear Rockingham, you should be like, hell is Rockingham type shit. You know what I'm saying? Hamlet. Like, yeah. Ellaby. People don't really know what them. Never heard of Ellaby. Yeah. <laughs> they know what Charlotte is. Everybody in the goddamn world know what Charlotte is. And Rockingham, yeah, man. and there's North Carolina too. So yeah, you gotta come deep. You got them. You gotta come deep. Yeah. You know what I mean? I want motherfuckers to know it's deeper than goddamn Charlotte. It's deeper than goddamn it's the 